All right, what's up guys? I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media back with another Dokkan battle video. So as you guys may know, usually when I showcase a new unit on this channel, they're almost always at max potential, right? At 100%. But recently I've been thinking that this doesn't always make the most sense as far as giving people a good idea of how good the unit's gonna be for them because the majority of the player base, like 99% of Dokkan players are not massive whales and they can't rainbow a new unit on their initial banner. So what I'm gonna start doing on this channel is showcasing these units at less than optimal status at, you know, maybe 55% with no dupes or 69%, nice, with one dupe like the Beerus or 79% with two dupes, 90% with three dupes. And I guess those are the only options, right? So it really depends on, you know, how my summons go or what I'm feeling. But I think this just makes a ton more sense and it will be a lot more useful for a lot more people. So let me know in the comments down below if you guys think that this is a good idea, if you want to see more videos like this in the future. And we're going to start here with this Fizz Beerus here with, like I said, a single dupe, but even with just one dupe. You'll see, this man is a monster. And the friend here also as a dupe as well, just one, so basically both rotations will be one dupe Beeruses. And we're on the legendary, sorry, not the legendary Goku event, we're on Infinite Dragon Ball history because I'm sure you guys are getting tired of just seeing the same Goku stages over and over again. So I decided to change it up a little bit here. All right, so first rotation is looking really nice. We got the double supports with Beerus and uh, he's already at 119,000 defense. Now keep in mind, he does get an additional 70% attack and defense after receiving an attack. So yeah, we should see some pretty good things here. Of course, he also has an active skill, which we won't see until at least uh, turn four, I believe. But this first attack will hit pretty hard. One dupe beers, by the way. There we go, 3.8 million. We're starting off the showcase at 3.8 million and we're critting for 5.3. Yeah. <laughs> I think this is also a good way to show people that you don't need like four dupes or even like just, you don't, you don't need a ton of dupes for a lot of these new units to be amazing. You know, like even at 55%, obviously Beerus wouldn't be able to crit, which is a bit of a problem. I mean, it's not a problem, it's just, it's nice to get crits. But even with no dupes, he will still hit really hard, especially when you pop that active skill. But with one dupe, the crit does make a big difference. All right, so on this turn, we got 2.8. Obviously, he didn't receive a hit. He is linked with LR Beerus, though. He, so he does have some good links going. But uh, that explains the drop off, obviously, from 3.8 to 2.8. Because we didn't take a hit, we did get the 35% support from Topo. But of course, the last turn, he had double support. So if you guys are curious about, you know, or confused about why the damage went, went, you know, down so much, that explains it. Okay, so now we got the homie Whis. And Whis, of course, provides 50% uh, attack support when he's on the same rotation with a Beerus. So right now we're getting 50%, I mean, once we attack at least, we're getting 50% attack from Beerus, or from Whis rather, I'm getting confused. 50% attack from uh, from Whis and 40% from the Supreme West Supreme Kai. And we are also taking an attack here. We do have type disadvantage, but the attack stat should be quite nice here. All right, let's see what it gets to. So there's the hit and we're up to 4.6 million now. By the way, if you forgot, Beerus actually stacks attack with every single super. So we're up to 4.6. That's not even close to his limit. I mean, technically, if you think about it, he has, he has no limit because he stacks infinitely. But uh, 4.6 is actually like just the tip of the iceberg, man. Okay, so now we're up to, or we're on the rotation with my Beerus again, and we can take an attack from Tien here. We have the support from the uh, Supreme Kai of Time. I'm getting the names of these like Supreme Kai is all mixed up. That's my bad. All right. 4 million here, 4 million here. Obviously, Whis, I do think is a better linking option because of that crazy extra 50% attack support. 
but uh, you know, having the double Beerus like LR Beerus and Fizz Beerus rotation here is also really good. This is actually just like a good team to run, man. I love doing this like double Beerus rotation just because he does so much damage, it's crazy. And LR Beerus too, actually. We're not here to showcase them, but LR Beerus or Beerus and Whis, um, is is no slouch either. Yeah, so one issue we might have here, honestly, is uh, not taking enough damage to actually get the active skill because I think we have to be below, if I remember correctly, 70% HP. Yes, yeah, 70% HP. So we have to actually try a bit to take enough damage to, you know, get the active skill. So if we were below 70% 70, 70 HP, we would have actually had the active skill here. But uh, unfortunately, we weren't, right? So we're up to 3.7 mil here without taking a hit. Um, yeah, pretty nice. Pretty nice. Beerus, I think, is showing you guys exactly why I was so hyped for him. Why, exactly why I wanted him so bad. Because some people were telling me, dude, you're being crazy. Why are you summoning for Beerus? And I was like, dude, I want him. I want him, man. Like, I, I need to have him in my box. Pause. Um... <laughs> No, for real though, like I really wanted him because I knew he was a monster, and I also wanted a super type realm of gods um, leader, like 170% lead, which obviously Zamasu was not. Um, Zamasu is a good unit, but just the fact that he was extreme, and usually I like to run, you know, mostly super type or all super type realm of gods teams, um, it was a bit of an issue. So that's why I liked having Beerus here. Uh, was that enough? No, I don't think it was enough damage. Hopefully, is there one more attack at the end we can take? Ah, we can't. All right, well, um, let's see. There's not much we can do, actually. You know, one other issue here is that Whis is actually healing us for 10% every turn. So even if we take some damage, he, he, Whis is just going to heal us right back up. So I mean, it, it's, a, it's a first world problem for sure. It's like a suffering some from success issue uh but if for the purpose of this showcase i really want to get that active skill so actually this this could be good we'll let tobo take a lot of those attacks at the end and as long as we don't die which would be very unfortunate for the showcase as long as we don't die then we should be below 70 percent hp at the beginning of the next turn all right so now we're looking at 3.3 mil by the way i didn't mention it but last turn we got almost 5 million all right, we were up to 4.9. We're still waiting for that active skill turn, though. Still waiting for the active skill turn. Thank you, 114k. That is perfection. That is exactly what I wanted. Now just don't die, Topo. Please. <laughs> it would be a shame if we finally fell below 70% and then got killed. <laughs> don't do it, Topo. Yo, tank a little bit. Tank a little bit for me. Wait. Wait. Hold on, are we are we still not below a hundred uh seventy percent HP? Let me let me check. Let me focus a bit. I think oh we weren't below, but we are now. We definitely are now. Okay, perfect. So we can finally pop this active skill. Um You know what? It would be better if we actually put Beerus in the middle here. Share links with both of them, but I gotta take that hit. So we're gonna pop the active skill, and then we're gonna get hit by Vegeta. And then we are basically going to one-shot Vegeta. This is going to do a lot of damage. It's effective against all. He gets 50% attack and defense. And uh, I just don't think Vegeta really has a chance here. We'll see. We'll see. Defense is looking uh, pretty decent. 152,000. Not the highest defense, but not bad by any means. And attack is the main thing that I'm focused on here. So there's the hit, and he just went over 8 million damage, or not damage, attack. Damage wise, 4.9. If that was a crit, would have been, what's the calculation? I don't even know, like 7 million, 6 something, really high. Either way, he's dead. Vegeta didn't stand a chance, like I said. <laughs> Bro. Oh, that was fun. That was fun. Okay, another turn. Another turn. Can we potentially one-shot Trunks here? Can we maybe one-shot Trunks here? That would be nice. Wait, hold on. Did we just heal back? Oh. Oh. 
Yeah, we heal back up when they're linked, so we can't actually get the active skill here. But you know what? I'll use it later. All right, we still got time. We still got time. The showcase is still fairly young. We're about 10 minutes in. I think we're gonna go a couple more minutes or a couple more rotations just so we can get a little bit more out of these guys, right? But um, there's no rush. All right, so 4.6 here, 4.6 here. And at this point, after seeing the 8 mil, you're like, meh, 4.6, what is that? That's, that's, you know, child's play. But if you compare him to like most TURs in this game, he hits stupid. He hits harder than a lot of LRs in this game, honestly. He really does. He hits harder than many LRs in this game. Um, it's, it's wild. <laughs> He, he kind of reminds me of like tech LR Broly in the sense where like he has that one massive nuke, right? But outside of that um, He still does really good damage Like without his active skill like he's still getting close to five million one dupe guys. This is not a rainbowed Beerus This is not a rainbowed Beerus. All right, hold on. Let me let me focus here one two three four five six. Ah oh, crap Why do I always do this? Why do I always do this? Alright, that's my bad. We missed one. I think Trunks is still dead though. This animation, I haven't talked about it yet, but this animation is clean, man. Super, super clean animation. We didn't kill him. The, the additional got went up to 1.7 mil though. Alright, sweet. So now we're facing all oh, this annoying Goku. Oh god, he actually, he actually dodges, right? That's gonna be a bit of an issue, guys. Um, he hits pretty hard, I remember that. So I'm gonna actually put LR Beerus here. Mm, you know what? I'm gonna trust Fizz Beerus. I'm gonna trust Fizz Beerus. LR Beerus does have more defense, but I'm gonna trust the Fizz Beerus to hold his own. All right. We're taking a hit 25,000, 4.8 million attack. I'm a little bit worried. Not the most worried, a little bit worried. Oh, you know what? Never mind. Never mind. After taking a hit, we went down from 25,000 to double digits. All right, there's the dodge. She dodges back. Yo! <laughs> what? I didn't see that coming. She has level 15 dodge, but that's it. Like she literally just has level 15 dodge. I I did not see her dodging two attacks in a row like that. That that's crazy. And then you have like UI Goku, who literally will not dodge anything. Yeah, that's 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 a lie. But there's been many a turn, all right, many a turn where my U L R U I Goku could have. Oh my god. 5.9. Five point nine. Wow. Okay. Um. What was I saying again? I don't remember anymore. I don't remember what I was saying anymore. Uh. Oh yeah. L R U I Goku. Yeah. He he's let me down a couple times. That's that's basically what I was saying. He's let me down a couple times. But damn. You know who's not letting me down? Fizz Beerus. Fizz Beerus is not letting me down. The only thing that I'm being let down by right now is the fact that I can't get his active skill anymore. That's the only issue I have, all right? That's the only issue. All right, 3.7 mil, I think, before didn't didn't connect. 3.9 mil this time is going to connect. Unfortunately, oh, there's a super, 150k. Thank you, that's good, that's good. We actually want that. We definitely want that. So what I'm gonna have to do next turn, like this turn, is actually, oh, you know what? I don't wanna heal up though. If we, if we got super last turn, we probably won't get super again this turn, right? <laughs> Famous last words. We probably won't get super again. We'll see, we'll see. If I die here, it's meant to be. If I die here, it's meant to be. All right, 6.1 mil. We will take all double digit damage after this, with the exception of supers, of course. But there's the double digit, yep, okay. And then we, s actually not bad damage, right? 1.4 for him, considering his defensive capabilities, is actually really good. 
Hey, we we actually got hit there. That's okay. Oh crap. Oh. I have never seen anything as clutch as this Supreme West Supreme Kai. What? Oh, this sucks actually, because I can't take a hit here. Um Hmm. Let me think. Let me think. Yeah, I'm not I'm not gonna use it. I'm not gonna use it. Because if I use it, it just feels like such a waste. It feels like just a waste if I if I use it here. So I think we can actually kill Goku anyways. Right? I, I think we can actually kill him anyways. So we're gonna save that. We're gonna save that. There we go. 2.8 mil. He's dead. And I think this is actually the final stage. No? Maybe? Close? Possibly? Uh let's put viewers there. Unfortunately we have type disadvantage again. Uh you know what? I'm, I'm gonna put Whis here. We're gonna let Whis do some dodging, do some uh, ultra instinct stuff, and then we'll make it to the next turn, use that active skill, and then that's gonna be the showcase, all right? That will be the showcase after that. If we make it there, I'm not really sure we will. I, don't, I really don't wanna heal up, that's the, that's the main thing. I really don't wanna heal up, because we gotta get that active skill, but uh, things are a little bit dire here, right? Because this dude's gonna hit us really hard. 34k? Alright, as long as Topo doesn't get supered, we'll still be alive. For sure. Hmm, alright. Alright, 44k, 43k, 48k, yep. Dude, come on. Why do you have to do me like this? Just, just give me one attack in the front. Alright, uh... Maybe we can survive one more turn. Alright, you know what? Let's, let's press that snake here. Let's press that snake here. And then we'll make it past the next turn. And then... We will come back to this turn. <laughs> and uh, we'll make it happen. Alright, so 4.4 mil here. So yeah, as you can see, man, his damage is just consistently very, very high. Obviously, the active skill turn is the highest damage output. But even without it, he just does so much damage. And defensively, he's not a slouch. Is he the tankiest unit I've seen? No, not even close, man. But I think he's pretty comparable with uh, STR Cooler, I think, as far as the defense goes. Which means, you know, he does well for most events and for most, most in most places. But he might struggle a bit, you know, here and there. Um for certain things so like, like for example like at the end of the legendary goku event he's gonna get hit pretty hard but in most things he has enough defense to hold his own all right here we go oh we're gonna super it here uh 167k that's actually good 6.7 million for the super one dupe beerus one dupe Beerus. I want to reiterate that. I want to make that very, very clear. All right, we got one more turn to make this happen. All right, if he if if he doesn't attack us in the front next turn, then I'm just giving up. Like there's 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 no way it's not gonna happen. <laughs> it's just not meant to be, man. The the Dokkan gods are like, nope. At least we got to see that first one. Okay, here. Oh my God. Why? Why? Man, that that is that is terrible. That is terrible. All right, so hmm, I think I'm going to pop the active skill still just because we we really we really can't I mean, I can't, I can't last more turns. I just don't want to make the video, like, any longer than it has to. It's already been very long. Uh, let's put this Beerus here. Alright. And then we'll super here. And we're good to go. That is going to be the last rotation, or last turn of the showcase, guys. I just, I couldn't make it happen, man. I tried really hard. 
but they were working against me. So instead of something crazy, you're getting 6.6 .6 mil. They're still very good. But that's still gonna kill Gohan, right? And of course, you get affected against, against all types. Type advantage there because of the secondary effect of the active skill. And uh, there you go, my friends. I'm gonna let this, this, this let this rotation play out, but I'm not gonna try to finish this. I probably could actually. You know what? We could. Maybe I will. <laughs> We're already this far. I might as well. Okay, 5.3 mil. We're not using any item, items though. I mean, I don't really need to need to beat this because I already did multiple times. So. If we get through this without using any items, then we get through this. If not, then we just die. That's that's cool too. <sighs> oh, he's gonna dodge this one. Yo, he's gonna dodge this. Come on. Of all things he doesn't dodge. It wouldn't be the super attack. Ah, <sighs> we letting me down, man. Letting me down. Alright, well, you know, there you go. I think that's the game's way of telling me that's long enough. And I agree, that is long enough. There is the showcase, my friends. I I really wish, man, I would have been able to get that active skill lock after he got the extra boost from the attack, but it's just we went you guys saw we went many, many turns and it just didn't happen. It just didn't work out that way. So either way, it doesn't detract from the fact that Biz Beerus is just insanely good insanely good at one dupe he doesn't need four dupes or three or two to just do crazy damage of course if he was rainbowed he would do even more but at 69 percent nice he's amazing and uh, i'm so glad that i went for him i'm so glad that i got him and uh you'll probably be seeing a lot more beers on this channel man because this dude's awesome. Okay, well, that's the showcase, guys. Let me know in the uh, in the comments down below. Once again, if you guys enjoy watching these less than 100% showcases, sometimes it'll be 55%, sometimes it's going to be 69%, sometimes it's going to be 79%. It really depends on how I'm feeling or how many dupes I personally pull. And uh, until next time, hope you guys enjoyed today's video as always if you liked the video then make sure to like the damn video and if it's your first time watching me first time to the channel and you like what you see then definitely hit that big red subscribe button to join the tiger squad now and while you're at it hit that notification bell too so that youtube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content and that's it i'm out of here until next time hope you guys have a fantastic fantastic day I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media, signing out.